Ibn Taymiyyah, Allah was thrown in prison many times. Yeah, Ibn Taymiyyah did time, man. He did a time. He did a bit. Ibn Taymiyyah did a bit, man. Why? Calling to the correct aqidah. Calling to the correct aqidah. The world of demons for what he did time for and what others have. He called to aqidah. To the correct aqidah. To the correct minhaj. They tried all types of matters. Ibn Taymiyyah Allah was jailed. And one of them who falsely accused me for that was Ibn Battuta. Ibn Battuta, his book has been translated to by Ransom. His book, The Travels of Matuza. You can go down to Devil Day or, you know, uh, Browns and Nobles. You can find it. Matuza, The travel, And you'll find this thing he lies about regarding even tell me in it. And that is, he said, I was in the, 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 the masjid in Damascus. And I see even tell me on the minbar saying, Allah, to God, this is from the throne, just like I'm walking down these steps right here. Kazza! Wallahi kazza! Lying upon Ibn Taymiyyah. Lying upon Ibn Taymiyyah, Allah. And at the time that Ibn Battuta visited Damascus, it's historically sound and found that he did not, Ibn Taymiyyah was not even there. He was in prison. Man was locked up somewhere else and you're making this claim against him. And when he visited Damascus, why Ibn Taymiyyah was in jail. But just not make Ibn, Ibn Battuta leave off his line, talking about he's seen him do this. Saying every night, Allah just sends the Lord heaven like my descent, and he came down and pooped step by step. Huh? If we read the Aqeel of Ibn Taymiyyah, we understand that this man must have been mad. And then now we got the same problem we have when they ascribe things to Ben Baz, and Ben Baz we know said something else. Or they ascribe things to Al Albani, and Al Albani we know said something else. We got two Albanis, and we got two Ben Bazes, and we must have two Ibn Taymiyyahs. 